Technology and Livelihood Education, Information and Communication Technology. Our topic is Tools and Equipment in ICT. Computer Programming, Visual Arts, Computer System Servicing, and Telecommunications. to learn we're diving into TLE it's your turn technology livelihood education so bright come on let's make it fun everything feels right The following are the objectives of today's lesson. Review of the previous lesson. Let ICT-related legal bases apply to the following scenario. Scenario 1. A student created a fake social media account, pretending to be a classmate, posting rude comments and embarrassing stories. Other students start commenting and sharing the fake posts. Scenario 2. A student downloads a copyrighted song, uses it as background music in their own video, and uploads the video to social media without giving credit or getting permission from the original artist. Scenario 3. A school collects students' personal information for enrollment, but later shares it with third-party companies for promotional offers without asking permission from the students or their parents. Content Area Vocabulary What do you call the programmable device that stores, retrieves, and processes data? Computer is a programmable device that stores, retrieves, and processes data. App is the short term for this word, and it is a software program designed to help a computer user accomplish a task. Application, or app for short, which is used in computing. It is a software program designed to help a computer user accomplish a task. The physical components of a computer system that you can see and touch, such as the monitor, keyboard, mouse, motherboard, CPU, RAM, hard drive, and printer. The hardware is the physical components of a computer system that you can see and touch, such as the monitor, keyboard, mouse, motherboard, CPU, RAM, hard drive, and printer. It is the set of programs, instructions, or data that tell a computer how to perform specific tasks, it cannot be touched physically, and it makes the hardware work. The software is the set of programs, instructions, or data that tell a computer how to perform specific tasks, it cannot be touched physically, and it makes the hardware work. The following are the tools and equipment used in ICT. The tools and equipment in computer programming. Computer programming relies on specific tools and equipment that help programmers write, test, and manage code effectively. Understanding these tools, from computers and keyboards to software like IDEs and version control systems, is essential for anyone learning to program. In this lesson, you will explore the basic hardware and software needed to succeed in computer programming. The main device used for writing code, running programs, and testing software is the computer or laptop. The following are the hardware tools using in computer programming, computer or laptop, the main device where code is written, tested, and debugged, 
the keyboard and mouse, essential input devices for typing code efficiently and navigating interfaces. The monitors, single or dual, larger, or multiple screens help programmers view code and documentation side by side. External storage, USB drives, external hard drives, used for backing up or transferring code and project files. The following are the software tools used in computer programming. Integrated Development Environments or IDES, comprehensive tools that provide editing, debugging, and compilation in one place. Examples, Visual Studio Code, IntelliJ IDEA, PyCharm, Eclipse, Xcode, Code Editors, lightweight alternatives to IDEs for quick coding and scripting. Examples, Sublime Text, Atom, Version Control Systems, VCS, tools to manage changes to source code over time. Examples, Git, Subversion, SVN. 4. The repositories and collaboration platforms, examples, GitHub, GitLab, Bitbucket. 5. The compilers and interpreters, tools that translate code into executable programs, examples, GCC, GNU Compiler Collection, Clang, Python Interpreter, Node.js. 6. Debuggers, tools to test and debug code, examples, GDB, GNU Debugger, LLDB, built-in debuggers and IDEs. 7. Package managers, tools to manage software libraries and dependencies, examples, npm, node package manager, pip, python package installer, maven, gradle, nuget, 8. Build automation tools, tools to automate the process of compiling code, running tests, and deploying applications, examples, Jenkins, Travis CI, Circle CI, Make, Ant. The following are the tools and equipment used in computer systems servicing. Have you ever wondered what tools professionals use to repair, maintain, or assemble computers? Just like a mechanic needs wrenches and screwdrivers, a computer technician relies on a variety of specialized tools and equipment to work safely and efficiently. We will discuss the essential hand tools, diagnostic devices, and protective gear used in computer systems servicing. Understanding these tools is the first step to becoming confident and skilled in maintaining and repairing computers. Hand tool. When servicing computers, students need tools like screwdrivers, pliers, and anti-static wristbands. These tools help with hardware installation, repair, and maintenance. The diagnostic software. Students can use software tools to diagnose hardware issues, check system performance, and troubleshoot problems. Example of these are MEM Test 86 for testing RAM for errors, CPU-Z. Identify CPU, motherboard, and memory specs, Windows Memory Diagnostic. Built-in RAM test in Windows. Task Manager Resource Monitor. Monitors real-time performance and resource usage, Performance Monitor, Windows. Advanced Performance Tracking, Check Disk. Scans and Repairs File System Errors, HD Tune. Checks Hard Drive Health and Performance, Hirens Boot CDPE. A toolkit with multiple diagnostic tools, Ultimate Boot CD, UBCD. A collection of hardware testing utilities, OEM slash built-in diagnostics, many brands like Dell and HP have built-in diagnostics you can access by pressing F10 or F12. Another tools used in computer system servicing are the cable testers and multimeters. These tools help verify cable connections and measure electrical parameters. The cleaning kits, keeping computers dust-free is essential for optimal performance. Some of these are mini vacuum cleaner or duster, compressed air duster, microfiber cloth, and other cleaning kits. The following are the common tools and equipment used in visual arts. Computer visual arts, also known as digital visual arts, is a modern form of artistic expression that uses technology as a primary tool for creation. In today's digital age, artists increasingly use computers, software, and digital devices to produce visual content such as illustrations, graphic designs, animations, and multimedia artworks. Just as traditional artists use brushes and canvases, digital artists rely on tools like graphic tablets, styluses, editing software, and high-performance computers to create art. 
These tools enhance precision and efficiency while unlocking new creative possibilities. Knowing the common tools in computer visual arts is key to exploring digital creativity and mastering modern techniques. The following are the common tools and equipment used in visual arts. First is the digital cameras and scanners. Students can capture images of their artwork or scan traditional artwork to create digital versions. The graphic design software. Adobe Photoshop, Illustrator. These tools allow students to manipulate images, create digital art, and design graphics. The tablets and drawing pads. Artists can use these devices to create digital illustrations and paintings. The 3D modeling software, the Blender and the Autodesk Maya. For students interested in 3D art and animation. The following are the common tools and equipment used in telecommunications. Telecommunications play a vital role in connecting people and businesses across the globe. Behind every call, message, or internet connection are specialized tools and equipment that ensure smooth and reliable communication. These include devices for signal transmission, testing, installation, and maintenance. Understanding these tools is essential for anyone interested in ICT, as they form the foundation of modern communication systems. The Common Hardware Tools and Equipment in Telecommunications the modems and routers, devices that modulate and demodulate signals for transmission over telephone lines or cable systems and route data between devices on a network. Examples, DSL modems, cable modems, wireless routers. Switches and hubs, networking devices that connect multiple devices within a network, facilitating communication between them. Examples, Ethernet switches, network hubs. Repeaters and extenders. Devices that amplify or regenerate signals to extend the range of a network. Antennas. Devices that transmit and receive radio waves for wireless communication. Examples, Yagi antennas, parabolic antennas, dipole antennas. Base stations, equipment that connects mobile devices to a network in cellular and radio communication. Examples, cell towers, microcells, femtocells. The following are the software tools used in telecommunications. Number 1. Network management software, tools for monitoring, managing, and troubleshooting network performance and connectivity. Examples of these are. SolarWinds Network Performance Monitor, PRTG Network Monitor, Nagios. Number 2. Communication Protocols. Software protocols that define rules for data exchange over a network. Examples, TCP IP, Transmission Control Protocol slash Internet Protocol, VoIP, Voice over Internet Protocol, SIP, Session Initiation Protocol, dot. Number 3. Telephony software, applications for managing voice communication over networks, examples, asterisk, free switch, Skype for business. A time to remember. This is Teacher Mylene. Thank you for watching and please subscribe to my YouTube channel.